The BMW E46 is a permanently on cigarette lighter. Back in the glorious 90s and noughties, this was handy because it meant you could light up your fag without having to turn a key. But nowadays, this can result in your gadgets remaining on, draining your battery, and resulting in needing a jump start. Thankfully, it's fairly easy to get this to come on with ignition, meaning anything plugged into the 12 volt socket will turn off when you turn off your car. To make this change, you'll need to access the fuse box in the glove compartment, which is opened by turning these small white clips. Simply put, the approach here is to move the supply of the cigarette lighter from a permanently live feed to a switched feed. Looking at the fuse box label, we see that fuse 47 has a 20 amp fuse for the lighter socket. Fuse 47 in the fuse box is clearly labelled as seen here. Looking at the circuit diagram, we can clearly see that the 20 amp fuse is always connected to the battery. A switched fuse rail which should be available for us to use is fuse 8, which is labelled as 5 amps. This is only active once the key has been turned into a new position. What we want to do is to connect the cigarette lighter load to this switched fused feed, like so. To do this you'll need to make a fly lead with the 20 amp fuse. Solder on blade terminals to fit into the fuse box. I got these from breaking apart a separate fuse. Technically speaking, if you use a wire gauge of less than 5 CSA before the 20 amp fuse, you're introducing risk, as that wire should be rated to the 50 amp ignition fuse. So only continue to do this if you do it properly, or you're betting there won't be a partial short in the exact wrong place. But of course, Murphy's Law applies. Plug one side of this into the top rail of fuse 8, and the other side into the top rail of fuse 47, as seen here. You should now have a 12 volt socket which is only on when the car is on.